Hi, this is Julie Waldorf, juliewaldorf.com, and I have Alana here, who is a single parent, and her husband, and is a single parent of five children. Five. Five children, wow. Okay, <laughs> and then three are out of the nest, mm -hmm. and you have two still in the nest. Yes. So could you tell me, as a single parent, what's it like to have three children going out of the nest? Is that easy? Is it hard? Or what's, what's the story in that? Um, I wouldn't say it was an easy transition to... Okay have them go out of the nest. Okay. Um, I don't think that, you know, in this culture, in our society, we necessarily have things timed appropriately for, mm -hmm. you know, graduating from high school at 18 and going out of the nest from there. Mm -hmm. It doesn't always work for everybody. Mm -hmm. So um, each one has been really unique. Mm -hmm. I will say that my oldest three who are out of the nest now mm -hmm. are doing well. <laughs> okay, that's good. But while they were going out of the nest, it was tough, wasn't it? While they were going out of the nest, it was really tough. Really, and really tough, wasn't it? It was really tough. Because it's hard not to have a partner checking on the other side. Cause it's they're... hard not to have a father figure. I, I don't know. Yeah. I'm sure it's hard on the other side if you're a single dad. Um, uh-huh not to have the nurturing mother aspect, but it, I feel like I've had to hold a hard line that mm -hmm. I'm not really comfortable holding. Mm -hmm. Maybe I held it a little too hard. Oh, did you? For okay. my older two. Yeah. Okay. And I lightened up a bit with my third as he okay. was doing his transition. And I'm just trying a whole new approach with my younger two. Um, okay, all right. Uh, Nonviolent communication, which okay. is something I've put into practice for years with my kids, but like more of that. Yeah, style. Pra really trying to focus on not losing it because they kind of push you to the limit, don't they? Right, of yeah. just responding to their needs. And, and with the father and, figure, yeah. as a single parent, of, for, for me, I, what I realize with especially boys, Without having that father figure to have that lower voice, they, they seem, they don't behave as well. No, they don't. <laughs> they get out of control and they kind of feel they can do whatever they want because they're bigger than you. They can walk all over you. Yeah, and yeah. you were pretty strict and it was really tough. Yeah. Yeah, because it was a constant battle. And I don't know if I would change it. I certainly, I mean, I feel like I've made a lot of mistakes as a parent. Yeah, yeah, yeah we all do. But that's what we do. Yeah. And I did the best I could and uh -huh. I think my kids are turning out great. Uh -huh. It just takes a little while, does it, sometimes after it yeah. seems like it's hard. I'm just really grateful that the older ones have come out the other side of Good. those difficult years and I feel more prepared to handle the two that are left mm -hmm. um, and it's so doable to have two kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It really is. Because five, five is a different story. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Holy smokes. I, I understand is, that. Is a miracle. It's, yeah, it's, it really is. Like, you got to have supernatural powers to yeah. do that. To get, yeah. I think, and you, and you do. As a single, you're great. You're wonderful. And you have, you're very successful. A successful single parent that has three out of the nest and they're successful and two more to go. And you're looking forward to it because you're, you're getting the swing of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so. And then I'm going to have my life. Yeah, yeah, and so. you're going to have your life, and everything's, everything's, well, you do have your life, but, yeah. Well, yeah. freedom. Freedom. In a way that I haven't had for the last 20 some yeah. years. Yeah, I get that, too. <laughs> anyway, yeah, especially as a single parent. Anyway, well, thank you very much for the interview, and you have a great day. You, too. All right, Julie Waldorf, juliewaldorf.com. Ciao, ciao.